Those pandemic EBT cards are hitting your mailbox this week, if it hasn't already. The extra relief is given to families of students who receive free or reduced lunch. ABC 27 Chantel Navarro tells us what you need to know before you go to the store. For some people, every day of the pandemic brings a new problem. I talked to one mom who says these pandemic EBT cards couldn't have come at a better time. In six days, I'm going to be seven. London and his older brother Andrew go to school here in Leon County and they receive reduced lunch. That means now their mom Elaine also received another EBT card this month. With the kids home more often, they could use the extra money. You know, we struggle one family income. We struggle, so it's definitely helpful. You don't need to sign up for them to get them. The PEBT cards are being mailed to every family whose child was receiving free or reduced priced lunch on March 16th. It's a one-time benefit of $5.70 per 55 days for each student. That's as much as $313 for some. You can use it for food like fruits and veggies, just not hot food. Look for the SNAP logo at the store. Towards the end of the month, we're, you know, kind of wondering, are we going to make it through to the end of the month food-wise? So having them home going, I'm hungry. Big Ben nonprofits are helping as well. Tallahassee Urban League Director Curtis Taylor says they're working with the city on a relief package for people that could give rent and food assistance. We've been working very hard in trying to bridge the gap with those families that have lost their jobs, those families that have been furloughed, those families that before the pandemic was living from paycheck to paycheck and now they don't have a check at all. Cards went out throughout the month of June to the address on your child's school district. If you're not sure if you qualify or if you haven't received one yet, just contact the Florida Department of Children and Families. In Tallahassee, Chantal Navarro, ABC 27. The PEBT benefits expire one year after you receive them. Now, if you received it on your current EBT card, those funds will be used first.